fall. Now's the perfect time to toss up a hearty salad and keep some fresh, color, colorful veggies in the diet. Yes, if you're trying to eat a little healthier, local nutritionist and author Rania Batina met me at Basco Appliances in Lake Oswego to share this recipe that you will definitely want to check out. Well, we are here with nutritionist Rania Batina, best-selling author of The 111 Diet. So good to see you. Thank you, Emily. Good to see you, too. So tell us, what are we making today? So today we're going to make a kale salad with crunchy chickpeas. Yum. Yeah, so this is a vegan dish. It's plant-powered, and it's got a lot of color and tons of nutrients and antioxidants. Love a good plant-powered dish. I know yeah. I try to be flexitarian, go plant-based when I can. Yeah, I always encourage my clients to have at least one plant-based meal a day, mm -hmm. and that's something that I do as well. Mm -hmm. So for this salad, we're going to start with the kale, but we're actually going to dress it as step one, okay. not at the end, because I really want the kale leaves to absorb the dressing mm -hmm. versus having all the other toppings, you know, take right. over really. You don't want to end up with that one sad, you know, <laughs> patch of salad that yeah. doesn't have any good flavor on it. Okay. Right. So let's start with that. Okay. So we're going to pour the dressing in. This is a tahini based dressing. So that's uh, made out of sesame seeds. And so this is vegan and Ooh. I can put the recipe up um, for the viewers. Oh, that when, smells so good. Yeah. So like I said, we're going to toss, toss, toss. And it's like, you can eat this alone, actually. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Just some tahini and kale, a great side with any um, chickpeas, or even if you are, you know, eating animal protein. Okay, so simple, okay. easy, right? So we're gonna, yep, we're gonna put here. this here. Next, we will. Fun toppings. Time. Yeah, we're gonna do marinated artichokes. Mm. So this just adds um, a little bit of um, olive oil in the marinade, and then spices, and as well as color and some texture. So let's just, yeah, I'm just kind of toss them all on there. Yes. Great. So again, toss, toss. It's already looking like a full dish. Okay, mm -hmm. next we are going to use the beets. Mm -hmm. um, rich in color, high in antioxidant. Let's just get that on. Okay. And go ahead. And, and you know, the beets and the artichokes, both of those are, are um, great things you can kind of keep as like a pantry staple, yeah. right? Yeah, actually both of those are canned items. I picked them up at Trader Joe's. They're so easy and you can cut them to your desired size. I mm -hmm. always talk about color, flavor, uh, texture, and fiber in a dish. Mm -hmm. And so you'll see that you know, the more color you have, the more appealing the meal is. And then also cutting vegetables up into different sizes, again, is also like a really nice way to display salads. Yeah. Okay, good. Next, we are going to do some uh, sunflower seeds. Awesome. Yeah, okay. so this is the healthy fat in the dish, in addition to the fat that's in the um, salad dressing with the tahini. A nice little crunch. Yes, a nice crunch. Mm -hmm. So do you see why we put the dressing on first. Right, you yeah. get it all mixed in there and then the toppings are gonna incorporate well anyway. But yeah. that way you don't wind up with like a top heavy salad. Exactly, and then last but not least, the star ingredient are crunchy chickpeas. Dun, 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 dun. So this is um, garbanzo beans, in mm -hmm. case you're not familiar what with what chickpeas are. Um, they're high in protein, high in fiber, they're a plant-based protein as well. And so um, let's just top the salad off with the yeah. uh, crunchy chickpeas. What a fun way to top it. I know. Here we go. Like this looks so good. You won't even miss the meat in the dish oh, when you have all. all this flavor, color, and then tons of nutrients. Yeah, if you do a little pinch of salt, uh -huh. that'll help bring out some of the flavors. Finish it off yes. there, just a little bit to yes, bring it please. out. And those chickpeas, um, they're pretty easy to roast yourself. Yeah, you can roast them with garlic. Um, you can make them a little bit more spicy with some um, red pepper flakes, or um, you can buy even like a seasoned mix, anything mm -hmm. you want. Give this a taste. All right, let's see how this works out for you. Oh my gosh, look at all those beautiful colors. I this know. is like everything I love in a oh, salad. Good. <laughs> yeah, so it's dairy free, gluten free. It's perfect with any protein, um, even if you're not a vegan mm -hmm. or vegetarian. It's perfect for a summer barbecue. And it's a, just a great way to introduce more color and flavor and uh, ingredients into your diet. Absolutely. Okay, yeah. I cannot wait to try this. So there's a lot of crunch, so much flavor, so many ingredients. Mm -hmm. I just I just love the salad. It looks great. Yeah. Okay. Mmm. Yum. I love the richness of that dressing. I would never know that it's dairy free. It's got all those great flavors, the crunch of that chickpea. It's so good. Delicious. So good. Okay, we're gonna sit here and enjoy our salad. You can check out more of Rania's recipes in her book, The 111 Diet. Get it on Amazon, and you can find this recipe on coin.com.